Well, here's the inside of my travel trailer. This is where basically where we sl we slept last night. There you go. This is where we sleep. As you can see, I add key, some hooks to put the keys up there. This is my light. You can turn this thing on. You can change the color to red, uh, green, blue. Actually, you can see it better at night, so I'm going to show that show you this maybe tonight. Okay, as you can see, oh, I didn't show you my TV. My TV's right there. It has a DVD player. So I think this is more like a 17 inch TV. I'm not sure. Or 20 inch. I think it's 20 inch. 20 inch TV. And then I added also this privacy curtain at night time because my my door I don't as you can see my door here has this uh, shade but see that but how did I expect us to put it down when you're inside you can't put it down because of the screen door so my solution to that is adding a curtain rod so now i just close this and now they can't see can't see there's my privacy curtain so okay. now i just what i did um, in order to, so it won't come off, I added this Velcro right there so it won't fall off. And then I added this Velcro around it so then it doesn't slip and slide off of it. And that's how I pretty much did that. See? Yeah. Anyways, this is my master bedroom, my master suite. I like this curtain because um, it keeps the cool air in and that part of the trailer and also privacy when you have other guests here. And this is my dinette. This turns into a bed as well. And here are my cabinets. Um, I have my clothes. I, these are clothes that I leave in here. I don't. It's clothes that I actually bought, of course, so I don't have to take it in and out. It's my camping clothes, uh, hiking clothes, uh, um, jackets here, um, swimwear. And there's cabinets over here. More clothes, t-shirts, and then I have. Other and then this is where I also keep my jacket, my batteries, uh, other other electronic stuff, and then I have my. Also, I have my ha uh, hammock for outside for outdoors activities. Here's my. my oops use about the potty pad that's where my little puppy go potty and this is my dinette it does have extra drawers here this is where I keep my dog food and this is where my okay my dog eats right there as you can see they knocked over my food as you can see I added some shoe rack there speaking of shoe rack here I added more. You can add your 
sandals like that. Sorry, it's dirty. Keep it off. Keep it away from the ground. And additional electrical outlet. I added some hooks here. It holds my garbage bag. As you can see, it's excellent for holding your garbage bag. Here. And then here, this is where you're going to see the carbon monoxide um, monitoring system. This is for my, this right here is my, my um, inverter. Turn on the inverter to use the solar. And my other storage right there. Here is my fancy drawer, sorry. My utensil. Oh, junk. This is supposed to be for the sponge, but I call it my junk drawer. And here's my sink. Excuse the mess. Here's my oven. I don't I haven't used it yet. And here I bought this new collapsible. I love this collapsible dish um, um, drying uh, dish rack so it's a collapsible see I haven't removed the tag yet anyways I love it because you could put it away also I haven't hooked up my home is where I'm with you this is my Exhaust fan light, and here's the fan. Okay, and here we have my drill. Oh, I have it full with, filled with junk food. And my plates. This is my microwave. It's a good sized microwave. Uh, right now I'm running on solar, so there's, I'm not hooked up to the electricity, to the DC, no AC, I'm not hooked up to the AC, right now I'm running on DC, um, and I need to fix this, this, I don't know what happened, I want to replace this with metal so I could put ma magnetic, and this is my Dometic, my Dometic, my fridge. I'm going to cook the steak later. I just, it was in the freezer, but I'm defro defrosting it. And this um, the Medic fridge, uh, I want to replace it because I want it to be a three-way fridge. It's only two-way. It's either AC, it runs on AC and on um, propane. So and it doesn't really work that good. So I'm going to replace that. So this is my fridge, and I added this. Um, this is this is awesome, you know. I mean, instead of having to look for, uh, if you want to organize things, look for things to like your cell phone, uh, any anything that's small, and you don't want to keep looking for it, you just put it all in there. You, I'm gonna start collecting hats and every. All of my um, adventure, all my destination, I'm going to be collecting hats wherever I go. This is when I went to Emerald Cove. This is when I went to Grand Canyon. Uh, so it's basically Route US 66. And okay. Okay, this is my upper bunk. Um, as you can see, I I, um, I had to replace my my bunk bed window. I don't know what happened to it, but it shattered, so I had to install a new window. And since then, I haven't put the balance back up because I still have to fix that roller shade. It seems like it's coming off. So here's the it's pretty deep the bunk bed. And here's, uh, I added this, um, I used to go tent camping as well, and or backpacking, 
and as you can see I have this self inflatable foam mattress it's, it feels so comfortable I just add it and it fits perfectly inside this bunk so anyways and it has its own light up there and the privacy privacy curtain and the bottom bunk is my like well it's another bunk I keep my drone my electronics and add in an, another another additional foam and right there you see I have my extra blankets pillows and here's the ladder that goes on the side and here as you can see I could open this and it's my garage this is where I put my my pots and pans over there any ad additional kitchen stuff that I need to use um, and all my other miscellaneous stuff there's my batteries and electronic gears here's all the scissors tape um, those um, 3d uh, what you call it um, I don't know two-sided tape I guess and you can close it originally I was gonna make this my my three dogs bedroom you know so that's why I added a mattress here too and a foam but um, I start filling it up with my own junk so that, that forget about that okay here's See, this is my cap. There you have it. Okay. Now you could add shoes up there. Shoes. Uh, basically, I just put all kinds of, you know, the toothpaste, my dog's uh, uh, doggy bag. A poop bag, poop bag, this poopy bag, and I still have to install this new hooks, my hooks, and I put my keys in here as well. Spray water, glasses. Oh. Okay. Anyways, and I did have a poster board up there. He's falling off, so I'm not even going to bother. This is my bathroom. I have the Max there running right now. This is my toilet. It's a foot, it's a foot, um, flush. Put water. And I added this basket. And, uh, I put uh, Velcro on here. And this is the one I was talking about from the roof. It's a Siphon 360 every vent cap so it any you know any odor it just pushes it back out real fast so i never had any issues with odor in here so here's my i keep my towels extra toilet paper you gotta have this for a pack this keeps your toilets smelling good I love this one. This smells really good. But anyways, I always have extra because I don't want to run out of that stuff. It's basically where I keep all my 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 dog shampoo for my dogs, and here's my all my uh, toiletries and hair products, hairspray, air freshener, and love is patient and kind. And hopefully my shower. Here's my shower. I just recently replaced my shower head with this uh, water saving um, shower head. And this is basically, if I could turn it on. You see, and you have this, that, and that, that. Anyways, we have three settings. 
Okay, anyways, to turn it off right there. And then we're done. And turn off the water. Okay, so turn on the water here. And then you can See how you okay? This is my new shower head. Oops, I'm gonna turn this thing off. I'm gonna waste my water. So here's the skylight from above on Max Air. It uh, sucks out all the hot air inside and brings in some cool air. So here's a little pouch. Oh, you could put um, your shaver, your, I don't know, little things like soap maybe, and toothpaste, toothbrush, or you could put it up here, I never use this, and this is the shower, so this is my whole bathroom, so there you have it. I have a mirror. I have an electrical outlet. Except where are you gonna you should have put a you should have put a shelf over here. So if you have an electrical outlet, where are you gonna put the curling iron? You should have put one here. Anyways, this is the light. Light. Turn it off. And where I hang my towel at. So, there you have it. This is my microwave, the stove. And this is how we live in my trailer. Oh, here's my solar panel. As you can see, um, this is my uh, heater. Heater at night. So, you could turn it on at night, set the temperature um, to like maybe 70 degrees. If it's too hot, uh, too cold in here. Here's my air conditioner unit. Right now I don't have it on because I'm running off of DC. Um, my solar and not AC. So the AC basically runs all the, the bigger appliances like the air conditioner and the microwave can't can't use these two off of your your battery you know solar uh oh let me turn off anyways this is and I recently bought this um paper towel holder it's magnetic see so you could you, it's awesome you know, I mean, because I don't have any, I don't want to, actually, I don't want to drill any holes on my, in my trailer. So I use, everything I use in here is one of those, um, the 3M, um, uh, we call that tape. Forgot what it's called. Anyways, the 3M tape that holds, so everything is all on, on, um, we call Velcro all be velcro strapped into it so I can remove all these lights and it holds pretty well so it holds pretty much like maybe 10 pounds and, and anyways um, here's my solar okay I don't know if you could see it without the reflection of the window maybe if I close the window a little bit anyways here you go okay Oh, that's even worse. Natural light back. Um, as you can see, I'm at 90%. I have all the lights on. I'm charging my phone. I was charging my drone. Charging all the other stuff that I need to run. Um, so, earlier it was bringing 10.5. Um, right now it's 
uh, 13.1 volt right now usually it goes all the way up to 14 volt um, and it's bringing only 6.2 amp because the Sun is it's actually coming down so earlier it was bringing and 10.5 amp from the solar so and smoke detector smoke alarm which is annoying sometimes when you're cooking I added this uh, carpet having three puppies or three dogs do you have I added this carpet because I don't want to ruin my my linoleum so there you have it see look at it's like entering into my master suite and there okay now you can actually See the outside this is what I wake up to isn't that awesome it's beautiful to wake up to nature you know life is so good when you wake up to a, you know a glorious view this is what God created and for us to enjoy and you can see my truck outside so if anyone messes with my truck I set off the alarm and there's my other window because my dogs will before when we're in bed they love to look outside you can look at the stars the moon and now and then you can watch the sunrise go up and here's gizmo gizmo here's my also here's my um my inverter uh electrical outlet it's ac dc Right now it's running off of DC and this is what I use. Oh shoot. Okay. Now let's see this is my TV. I added that. There's my radio. Um uh, okay. It's my Wi-Fi extend extender. Uh oh. Turn thing off. I'm not using it. Okay. So, look at that. I just love the view. I love nature. Camping is my favorite thing to do in life. I could do this every day if I, you know, if I had the opportunity. But, I. I still I do appreciate my home my home base I like to have my home base where I could go home to as well and well that concludes my video my tour of my mobile crib that concludes um, the whole tour I hope you like it. Don't forget to subscribe and click on the notification bell for more upcoming videos. Also, I'll let you go now. Bye.